Good morning, happy Wednesday. I did not vlog yesterday because I was at training all day and I just felt like I didn't really need to. Um, nothing all that exciting happened yesterday, um, in school life anyway. Um, yesterday was kind of, kind of like an emotional roller coaster. I feel like my emotions like all day were like just up and down. Um, like, I, I don't know how to explain it. We... We have the offer on our house now, and we kind of got that figured out for the most part. We're not, we're still not like in contract with them, but um, that should be happening like today or tomorrow. Um, but then we, the place that we wanted, I still want it, but at the same time, I like immediately after like we had gotten word that like it was pretty close to being ours I got this like just sense of anxiety and like I regretted it um which I'm like a very big buyer's remorse person so that doesn't really surprise me and then so I'm like okay whatever like you know I that's just me but then I'm looking online last night at a different city which I had never looked at before because I was set on not living there and I found it in like a completely different area of that city that I would really, really like. And it was the first house that popped up just on the market yesterday. And it's like right where we want to pay and it's perfect and it's nearly brand new. Like in terms of housing, it's built in like 2011, I think, which in terms of housing, that's like basically brand new. Um, and then now I'm like, Maybe that's why I regretted it because it's not the right choice. We still don't like even for sure have it and it like that other house it is completely up to us to be like no we don't want it. Um, and I love the house I just don't know. I think the area is what's throwing me off. Like I love the house and I think it's a perfect house for what we'd want. It doesn't need that much work. It basically just needs flooring and a new kitchen, which is what we're going to do in pretty much any place that we go because no place has the kitchen that like I'm looking for. But the area isn't bad where the house is, but like the bad area of that town is close by, which that's kind of like what we deal with where we live now. And we just don't like see it. We don't notice it because um, we don't go to that area. But I don't know. So, I don't know. So yesterday I just felt like I'd get like super excited and then I'm like, oh wait. And then like, I don't know. It was just, it was crazy. So we had our training yesterday. It went okay. It wasn't even a training. We were like looking at the essentials again and kind of ma making sure that they match what they need to know for going into third grade. And then um, I actually ended up going to the school afterwards so I could change. But I got there like right when school was pretty much um, like all the kids had just left. It was like 3.30 and my kids did awful yesterday with the sub and I'm so sad about it. Um, I don't know. I don't know. I ended up calling a few parents because that's just not okay. Um, yeah, so I don't know how today's gonna go. I mean, I'm gonna make it a great day, but I'm definitely gonna have to like lay it on my kids that you know that's not okay to treat a sub like that especially because the sub that they have is someone that they really like and it's like a very good friend of mine um like outside of school even so yeah kind of a bummer but it is what it is I guess so Skylar's gonna go look at the house today while I'm at work he's gonna go with his mom because they wouldn't let us do a blind offer because I was ready to like put an offer on that place last night um because I don't know like what could even be wrong with it if it's a like if it were not a brand new house I probably would um have been like no I need to see it but this place it's just like there's not going to be much wrong with it that we couldn't just fix um especially at that price and yeah so I'm gonna go drive by it right now because it's kind of on my way to work kind of not really but I'm gonna go out of my way so I left early it's only 6.50 right now, so I'm going to drive by there. He's going to go, and then hopefully right after that we'll put an offer in, and then maybe that one will just be easier. That's another thing is, like, with the other house, I feel like they keep asking for more and more and more and more things. Like, they're mad about our, us being contingent on our house selling and, like, all this stuff, so I'm like, maybe that's a sign that it's just, like, not meant to be. And then the fact that I had never looked at that city, and then the second I looked, 
I find this like absolutely perfect house and a perfect neighborhood. Um, the first one and it was uploaded like yesterday. So because of that, I don't know, everything happens for a reason and then maybe it's a sign. So I'm going to go to school. I don't think we have a staff meeting this morning. Hopefully we've had a staff meeting for like the last four weeks and it's usually only like every other week. So I don't know. I'm assuming we don't have one, but I have a lot of work to get done this morning. So I'm going to go. I'll catch up with you guys after school, except for I have to go to another training after school today. <sighs> So I'll catch up with you guys at some point today. <laughs> Whoa, why is it so blurry? Okay, it's the end of the day and I have to head out like right this minute, but I wanted to really quickly show you my outfit before I go because I'll change before I see you guys again. So I wore this black, it's like a jean jacket, but it's a black jean jacket. I have this little necklace on and then I have this like maroon burgundy color stripe, or stripes, no, polka dotted dress from uh, Old Navy. And then I wore some booties and that's what I'm wearing today. So I'll catch you guys up on my day later and yeah, and any house stuff because once again, that house that I was talking about this morning is not going to work because the taxes are really, really high for various reasons. And so it would make our payment like out way higher than we had expected. So <laughs> it, at this rate, I'm just, I'm just never going to move. So never going to move <laughs> ever. <sighs> Hello. So let me, yeah. Okay. So I'm home now, <laughs> obviously, and it is currently, oh wow, it's not even seven o'clock yet. Wow, I can get home and like get so much more done early when I don't go to the gym. <laughs> I didn't go to the gym today. I was driving, I went to that training. It was like an hour long. So I put it at like 4.45. I drove by a house because it was like, once again, kind of on the way back. <laughs> sort of um so I drove by that place just to see what the neighborhood was like didn't like it um and then I was driving home and Skyler called and was like we got to make a decision about stuff so I decided to skip the gym because I feel like I just needed to get home and like just kind of talk to him so every time I feel like I get on here I've changed my mind or changed my feelings or changed our plan or something with our house <laughs> like every time and then every time something new happens i'm like man i wish i hadn't even unlocked that because now i've like changed it again and once again it's just like it's an emotional roller coaster i'm not like emotional but it's like an emotional roller coaster as in like there's like very like high points where i'm like yes this is so awesome it's gonna be great i love this place i love that place or whatever and then you know, something happens and then we're like, oh man, like that stinks. Like the house today that I was like, oh my gosh, I love like this morning. This guy went and saw it and then everything was like fine and dandy until we figured out how many, how much the taxes, the property taxes were. Whoo. Yeah. Um, that was let down. So I literally tacked on like $300 per month on top of your monthly payment, which like $300 a month is a lot just for taxes. <laughs> Um, and that's if they don't continue to go up, which there's a good chance that they would. So anyway, we basically are down to two houses. We're just waiting on the people to like finish up their paperwork. Every time they need to fix something on their paperwork, which they keep making mistakes. And every time they need to fix it, it takes them like 12 hours to get it back to us, which is ridiculous. But the people, the house that we want to buy is completely like waiting just for us to say that we're in contract with them so yeah i'm giving you guys like way too much information about my life that you probably don't care about but i'm just kind of venting so today overall it was a good day i was actually like not very pleased with my kids obviously Hi. hello was not very pleased with my kids this morning because of the whole sub it's in incident yesterday. Um, I told them that he told me he never wanted to come back to my class, 
which they were pretty upset about. Um, and they've made better choices today. I had kids sit out at recess today who were on yellow, orange, or red um, on the clip chart. And then anyone whose name got put down, whoops, who's got whose name got put on the list as being like exceptional got to come in at lunchtime and play inside which they like to go on prodigy and stuff like that uh and play like with the stem bucket so they got to do that so they enjoyed that um but overall i assigned seats today i was like a stickler about every little thing um just because i wanted them to like realize that i was really upset about the way that they had treated him and um so i think it helped um tomorrow's already thursday I have PE tomorrow and I have library right afterwards. So I have no ELA block, which is great. I just have to do math in the morning and then guided reading in the afternoon, which will be easy peasy. So that's fun. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. I like things going through my head that I keep thinking about, but so i already ate dinner and we had finally had those tacos the chicken tacos that i was going to make the other day which totally not healthy at all which why did i choose to do that on the day i didn't go to the gym but whatever it is what it is and the training that i went to today was on it was a pbis training and it was all about restorative circles which is like everyone <laughs> it's like it reminds me of like an aa group everyone just like comes clean about random stuff so like we were doing it in like learning how to do restorative circle and so like everyone went around and said something that in their life that they remember has made them angry and then something that's like happy and everyone just like shares one thing and it it really does like open everyone up a lot and you like really quickly learn things about people that like you may never ever know um because it, i was in a group of there was like 10 of us that had gone and i didn't know anyone there and so, but by the end of it, like, I knew a lot of information about these people that kind of gave me insight to their life. Um, so it was kind of cool. I kind of want to try something like that with my kids. So, yeah. But before I go, because I see this out, look at how cute this is. It's this little light pink with glitter um, polka dots. Uh, I don't, I, I, I mean, I guess it's just like a pouch. I'm using it as a pencil pouch, but from Kate Spade and I think it's so stinking cute. I'm using it for my like to and from school pencil pouch that I keep in my bag for like trainings and stuff. Um, but my, I guess she's like my aunt kind of, I, just like one of those family members. Like I don't even, I do know how they're related but I don't know what you'd call them. Um, she got it for me for Christmas but I haven't seen her. So my mom just gave it to me the other day or last weekend. So super cute. So. I'm gonna go ahead and end off the vlog here. Um, I'm really sorry, like the vlog uh, production, I guess, quality has decreased just because I feel like we've been so busy. Like I just don't have the time to put into like filming all these little tiny clips all the time and I just can't lately, like I don't know. And it's not even that I don't even have the time. It's like I don't have the energy to put into it. Um, and then Skylar's been so busy that like I don't want to put that on him to have to do all this extra stuff. Like it's a lot easier for him to edit the vlog that it's just like me just talking for the most part. He doesn't have to do like a bunch of music stuff and all that. Um, because he was super busy for a while there with trying to fix up all the outside of the house and like little things on the inside. So... It's slowed down a little bit, so I'm trying to like increase that a little bit, but it's just gonna be like that for like a couple, like a while. Cause once we get into escrow on a house, then we'll basically just be working like on cleaning and packing. Although I guess we have 45 days. Like once it opens, it'll be a 45 day escrow. So we have a time, but it's definitely gonna go quick. Um, and then I'm gonna be gone in Phoenix for like three days, three or four days in uh, two weeks. And then just like a lot of little things. So I do apologize. I hope you guys are still enjoying them, but yeah. So goodbye for now. Um, if you did enjoy this video and you enjoyed my daily vlogs, make sure you give it a thumbs up so I know what you guys are enjoying seeing and what you're not enjoying seeing. Um, 
and I'm gonna be filming this weekend for my February videos. I didn't get to do them last weekend, just, yeah, so. <laughs> life, life happens. So, <clears throat> I will see you guys in the morning.